Bees were living in the wall of this house and I was called to give the bees a new home. So I opened up the wall and inside I found a giant hive full of very gentle bees. And to my surprise, almost immediately I found the queen. I was really excited since this hardly ever happens in a hive this big. So I put the queen in a clip to keep her safe and I put her into the new hive. Then I started to remove each piece of comb. It looked like this queen had been very busy lately because this hive was packed full of baby bees. All of these little white larvae would eventually turn into baby bees, and saving these pieces of comb is one of the most important parts of the bee removal process. So I just kept removing each piece of the hive, and whatever I removed from the original hive, I saved for the bees to have in their new home. These bees had everything they needed to survive, and they had a ton of honey. I had been working for about two hours by now, so I helped myself to a bite of honey, and it was delicious. But after I was done removing all of the comb from the wall, I still had to help get the bees into the new hive, so I started scooping them up with my hands. But there were so many bees that I decided to build a little bee bridge, and pretty soon, all of the bees started to rush over the bee bridge and into the new hive to be with their queen. So I gave the rest of the bees some smoke and I waited for them to get into the new hive. Then I closed up the hive, I took the bees home, and it was another great day of saving the bees.